This little chapel is called Our Lady of the Angels, St. Mary of the Angels. It is also known as the Porziuncola. Porziuncola is an Italian word which means little shrine, little portion. This particular chapel was built in 1936 by the Sisters of St. Francis here in Sylvania. It's a very close replica of the chapel in Assisi, Italy, the original Porziuncola, which was restored by St. Francis. Francis was born in 1181 in the town of Assisi, and in the year 1206 he received a call from God, and his response to that call was interpreted as a responsibility for him to repair the church. Francis took this literally and began begging for stones and money to repair the churches in the town of Assisi, Italy. One of those churches that Francis restored was the original Porziuncola, the little portion, St. Mary of the Angels. Francis worked for two years in this restoration project, and as he worked, he began to reinterpret the meaning of his call, which in fact became a call to repair the church, the people of God. People were inspired by his actions and began to join him in his labors. He then became the founder of the Franciscan Order, and the Porziuncola to this day remains the heart of the Franciscan Order. So we, the Sisters of St. Francis, are blessed to be able to have on our property a very close replica of this shrine. The shrine is open every day from 8 in the morning until 5. Its unique purpose is similar to the one in Assisi. Francis had his followers build huts around the little chapel. They lived in the huts. They planted shrubbery to create a cloistered effect because this was a quiet spot. This is where they stayed. This is where they prayed. This is where they contemplated God in nature and in this little church. So we have provided a little church, St. Mary of the Angels, the Porziuncla, here in Sylvania for the exact purpose. A place of quiet so people can come and pray contemplate the goodness of God and come to know who God is in their life. There is a unique feature to this chapel. There are many, but one I would like to share with you today is particularly grounded in our property. We had a severe storm uh, several years ago and a large white pine tree uh, was destroyed. I salvaged the, the tree trunk, took it to the sawmill, had the tree boarded out, we dried the boards, and Mr. and Mrs. John Kuzma rebuilt these doors from that white pine that once was planted on this property and grew. It was planted by Mother Adelaide and the Pioneer Sisters in 1916. The doors are built in a European style. There are no screws, no hardware, no, nothing to attach them. It's all wood. And these are the panels. And you can see the dowels that hold the wood together these panels. So this is the original strapping that was uh, on the first doors that were on the chapel in 1936. But again, they were rebuilt and this is white pine from our very campus. So we hope that you come to the chapel for the purpose for which we built it. To spend quiet time with God and to get to know who God is in your life.